Norman and Kenny. No sign of any of the squirrels as yet. I've got to go out shortly as I need to fill up my car with petrol as I'm off to Cambridge for a few days tomorrow. So we'll see if anybody turns up once I'm back. So Kenny is fast asleep on my bed. I'm now going to go and find Norman. And Norman is on my computer chair, bless him. And here we are again, going to Tesco's, popping in for a few bits for Carol whilst I'm away, and then I'm going to go over and get my petrol. Right, so I am now home. I have filled my car up with petrol, and we literally just bought a few bits, some bread, milk, um, a little bit of veg, because that's all that we needed, because we seem to be shopping all the time, so I'm sure there was nothing else, and I don't think we've missed anything. Anyway, I'm home now. I've just unpacked the little bit of shopping we had. Just come out to check to see if any sign of Sybil or Barry, but nothing. And I've dropped Carol at her friend's, so I've got a bit of peace and quiet for a couple of hours. I'm going to start cooking a dinner, though. So I'm sat here now in the peace and quiet because Carol is still at her friend's. I've got dinner cooking. I've got the washing machine on. I run, run the vacuum round upstairs and downstairs. The bathroom was cleaned earlier on. Uh, Norman is still on my computer chair. Kenny is still up on my bed. 
so i'm just sat here at the moment did i say i've got the washing machine on anyway the washing machine is on dinner is in the oven i don't know if i've said that already as well and i'm having a coffee and do you know what that sip is as good as the first so all i've got to do now is sort the fox food out pick carol up have dinner have a shower pack my bag for my travels tomorrow because the car's ready to go and then sit and chill this evening and wait for the foxes it's just i don't know what's going on with them again i think possibly the weather's paid, played a big part in that because we haven't seen chip for a couple of nights only caught on the overnight camera but at least she did turn up last night so let's hope she turns up tonight but failing that, this will be the last day of videos from me for around, I don't know, six, maybe seven days. Um, because obviously I'm going to Cambridge tomorrow. My dad's funeral is Wednesday at 2pm in the afternoon. So whilst in Cambridge, you might get the odd video or two from some of my family if they want to be idiots again. But we'll see how it goes. Okay, so if there aren't any videos, you know why. Um, and if I get to do any of my family, then I will. And if there is anything from the overnight camera, I can access I eh, can't talk now. Access that whilst I'm away. So I'll see what I can do there as well. So at least there'll be should be something each day. But if there isn't, you know why. Anyway, I'm gonna finish off my coffee, check on the dinner, go and pick Carol up. And then I'll say, you know the rest of what I'm going to do. Yeah. So, and I'm trying, I'm sitting like this because there's no glare from my um, glasses if I sit at this angle. So that's the reason I've done this. There you go, you've got a glare. No glare. I don't know why my eyes went like that because... There was no reason for that. But there we go. Right, let's go and see what's occurring in the kitchen. And then get on with the rest of my evening. I'll see you soon. So there was a change of plan. I phoned Carol to say I was going to go pick her up. And she says, do you think I could have another half an hour? It's like a child saying, please, mum, let me stay out another half hour. So I decided I'd come and have my shower early, so I'll just go and drive in my PJs to pick her up. No big deal. Right, I'm now going to go off and I'm going to brush my hair first. And then I'm going to sort the fox food out, go and pick Carol up and then come back. And hopefully dinner won't be far from being ready. Hopefully. I'm in the car and I'm going to go pick Carol up. Dinner is almost ready, so we'll be able to eat probably five minutes after I get back. But she's only five minutes up the road, so I won't be long. That was a good bit of fading out, that. I like the interior light of a car. You can just see my glasses. Today's dinner is roast chicken. Carol's got a couple of roast potatoes and a couple of pieces of roast carrot. Boiled potatoes, green um, stringless runner beans and broad beans. I don't like broad beans. And I've got the stringless runner beans, the roast... Um, what have I got? Roast chicken. Roast onion, roast carrot, roast potatoes, then my best gravy jug, but there's a really thick chicken gravy in that. So I'm going to go and have my dinner now.